Hello, my lovely Taurus. How are you, loves? I hope everybody is well. Taurus, welcome to your next 30 days reading. Yes, you hear correctly. And thank you for all of you who did request this reading. The next 30 days, how they look like and what we need to see and hear from the spirit that is coming and that is here. Sun, Moon, Rising Science and Venus Science for Tauruses. Let's see loves. We have the Hermit right here. Still very much into looking towards a situation. Could be a work-wise situation. Could be a relationship. And I feel here you, you might take some time here to, to look into it and then kind of like now I see, now I recognize this and what's the next steps. So Taurus, I see here there is something here you're thinking to leave behind and to move into something new. Let's see. Knight of Swords. Nine of Cups. Ten of Wands. Strength. Emperor. Page of Wands, Nine of Pentacles, Nine of Wands, and Death. Yes, I feel here, indeed, here there's a lot of changes happening. And you deeply thinking of, for some of you, you could be a little anxious. I see the Nine of, we have three Nines. Ten of Wands and the Death here, which the the Nine missing is Nine of Swords, overthinking, being a little anxious of what's next. For some of you, it's just like you you appear a little stable or appear very calm, but for sure you are looking forward to something new. Whatsoever I see here, this change is happening. And whatever change you are making now, you could resist in the past. It's like your, your voice deep inside is telling you, is this where you are like or there is something else you want to do. Or there is something here that you deserve. Let's see. Ten of Wands. Six of Swords. Yes. Ready to put a burden down. Nine of Wands. Seven of Cups. You could resist because you still looking for the options out there. But I feel here the action is happening as we move into the Cancerian season. And the Cancerian season starts on June 21st. And going all the way to, I believe, July 22nd. And... Whatever here is, if you in the past were looking quite, I don't know what to choose, I don't know what's there, I'm quite hesitant. I feel here in July, there is action, there is movement. What's the change here? Because death energy many times speaks about something here, it's over. And something here, it's about to start. It's a new beginning. Absolutely, world. 
a chapter into your life it's closing and I feel here for some Tauruses are quite thankful for what this chapter brought and there is movement let's see here Emperor what's the decision here ten of cups I just want to be happy I don't want to be hurt I don't want to be stuck I don't want to be in a situation when I always got to be the strongest one, but not the happiest one. And not anymore. This is not me anymore. Six of Wands, absolutely. Following your intuition. Not staying wherever you are. And I feel here is like if you could be in the past like, you know, just a little bit more. I can more. I, I need to stay strong more. I need to be, you know, in this. But now it's just feeling like, you know, do I really want this to stay where I am? And you could resist the move because you didn't yet figure it out. And once you figure it out here with the King of Swords, it's like I'm looking whatever I had and what I want to and then the movement is happening for some of you there is actually a change of home there's a relocation energy yeah for some of you choices you leave a life partner or somebody who you you feel like you are more in a cold connection could be a hot cold connection but you always got to be the better person and they always you know being the one who complain they always were something but now I feel here you just like you know let's leave that behind you can stay with your complaints I gotta move forward for some of you Tauruses, you might left behind an air sign and you might go towards a fire sign. I see strongly Leo. But yeah, that's you. Moving forward. You know, it might be a little slow, but yes, the movement is happening. Also, for many of you Tauruses, it's not necessarily that you're moving towards somebody, but you you are able to see that there is other better things for you. You you could understand that there is now just survival in a connection, but there is actually living or enjoying a connection. And I feel here, through that, you are shifting your energy. Let's see here one outcome of all this or one advice for you. Ace of Cups. Here you are. And Ace, Eight of Wands. New things. Could be new love. For some of you, you you might left a job behind. You might left something indeed behind. But I see you quite excited of the new chapter. And you feel here that there is more to explore for the future. Which that very much speaks for the Taurus that... I'm looking for something stable, but I'm not into any rush to. And that's the way to go sometimes. Let's see here, Taurus, one oracle for you. Know your worth, number 54, which sums up to nine. There is something here that this ending going on is very much speaking you that Never ever low your self-esteem. Know your worth. And underneath we have number eight. Bum cut spirit. Life is a mystery. Reclaim your power. 
and trust the great mystery. Here you are, loves. You are very powerful. And sometimes, you know, start something here that over the sudden you are understanding what is there for you. And that's how you are moving. Eight of Wands. It's kind of a total new world. Very different than what you had prior. And I feel here this is totally worth to be explored. And yeah. Good job, Taurus. And I thank you so much coming in and continuing with these energies. Love and light to all of you. And we'll see you next time. Namaste.